So in this video, we're going to learn how to use Citation Machine. Now the first thing you want to do is you want to go to citationmachine.net. You'll notice the first thing this site asks you to do is to select your citation style. So you can select between APA, MLA, Chicago, or you can select a different citation style by clicking on more and selecting whatever citation style you want to. So let's go with APA. Now, you'll notice that the site offers you various options. You can cite a book, a magazine, newspaper, website, journal, film, or something else. So let's go with book. And you can search books by title, author, or by the ISBN number, which is very specific. And the best option out of the three, because if you know the ISBN number, you will get that very specific book. However, if we search by title, we may end up getting multiple results. So let's say I want the Archaster. Let's say I want to cite it. So as you can see, I'm getting multiple results because there are various versions of it. So make sure you know your who your publisher is and this is even more important if you're citing to a specific page number so let's go with this result you of course have to select the result that you require here's a short summary of the book you've told you've chosen so you can verify the details quickly and once you're done you click on final step notice that um, the site has auto filled most of the details here for you so you can quickly verify everything before you click on create citation right here now this is if you want to cite the whole book if you want to cite to a specific page number you click on cite a chapter over here and you can put in the page number so we'll click on create citation and there we have it here is our citation we can click on copy and paste and this will basically copy our citation now we're free to paste it wherever we want there you go so now if you want to cite a magazine newspaper journal the process is very similar you simply put in the title if you want to cite a website, you can do so either by searching by keyword or by entering the website URL. In my opinion, entering the URL is a better option because it's more specific and therefore it is a quicker process. So let's add a news article. So let's go with this. copy the URL oops there we go and paste it my mouse is being really bad today so please bear with me click on select Here's a short summary, click on final step. Verify your details. So it forgot to, it didn't catch uh, the date the article was electronically published on. This is most probably because we cited a very recent article. And I believe the publishing date would be today itself. There we go, August 15th. So that's one day before today. 15th August 2017. And 
everything else is fine you click on create citation and there we go we have it so that's it for this tutorial let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below and thank you for watching